Hi there guys, welcome to SSMMarketing.tv. I hope you're enjoying our TV shows. Today's TV show is continuing on with our, our theme of market research, but we've now moved on from keyword research and we're doing some secondhand research. So um, you'll notice that uh, in the next coming days we've got some blog posts and training videos coming up to show you how to go and do market uh, secondhand market research using something like a forum or Twitter. Um, or using social media. Now, today I want to talk to you about why I think um, the, the change in, in the way that the internet works really starting to help us to do a higher level of market research, but also to help people who are new to internet marketing to get started a lot quicker. Now, seven years ago when I started doing internet marketing, there was really two major mechanisms for generating traffic, and that was search engines through search engine optimization or search engine marketing, or referrals, and that was through emails or um, email marketing or affiliate marketing or banner advertising. Those were the major two streams of generating traffic to your website. But now, with the invent of technology and the growth of Web 2.0, which is now we're leading into Web 3.0, there's been this thing called social media. And so with the event of social media, it's now become a lot easier for people to generate traffic because we've got multiple areas to generate traffic from. We've got search engines, we've got referrals, now social media as well. But also because most of us actually have a social profile out there. We have a Facebook page, we maybe have Twitter, maybe we're on LinkedIn, and we've already got some friends and mechanisms through those social media platforms where we can start to promote our website. So we're going to talk a little bit later on in, in a further series of TV shows about using social media to generate traffic. But today we're talking about using social media to do market research. So if you do have a Facebook group or um, a Facebook page, why not do a status update saying, hey, I'm thinking about launching a new internet business. Does, do you guys have some ideas about what I could do? Do you have some ideas about what you're looking for? Or if you've got an idea, maybe you say, hey, this is an internet business idea I've got. What do you guys think about it? So we can start getting some, some social interaction with you so that people are not only getting to a point where they're getting interested in doing business with you, but they're also contributing to your business ideas and um, you're getting uh, you know some of the hands-on research that you need because if you're going to start an offline business, well, you know, we're obviously going to go and try and find out does our store have enough um, street frontage to get traffic, so that's keyword research. But the next thing we're going to do is go and look around and say how many other businesses are there competing with ours and what do these businesses do and what are our potential customers looking for and where's the part in this um, social economy where my business can sit. So this is where social media comes into play where we can start finding a little bit more out, out about the lay of the land and about the layer of, of the internet space for our current niche. So make sure you, you do spend some time in this secondhand research because this secondhand research is not only going to be able to devise where your business is going to go, but it's also going to allow you to start gaining some momentum when you do launch this business. So I hope you enjoy um, this TV show and I hope you're enjoying the content that we're producing for you guys. This is Sean signing on out.